Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Westeros Total War, Enhanced Alpha, House Stark. When we last left off, we were actually in the battle that we're about to go into right now. Unfortunately, my game froze, yeah, so we'll have to do it all over again. We didn't really get very far, we managed to push back the outer defences uh, into the thing, and we managed to capture the general, whether or not we'll be able to do that again. For his sake, he better not, because uh, Rick and Stark is not going to be as lenient as his brother. All that time with the uh, savages and cannibals on that damn island is, uh, well, it's changed him. At least that's why I always had the image of Rick and Stark returning as uh, a bit more like the Starks of old than anybody else. But let's do this. Let's get these guys out of the siege equipment because they're going to be on my ass again. Delayed again. Let's go and do this my way. Attack. Have all day. Don't give him time to repair. Turn him off. Only intervention by the Almighty Lord or a military genius can bring us victory from this mess. battle seems to be swinging in our favor. From such tidings does victory emerge. It might be a bad idea to do this, but uh... It's too late to turn back now, bitches! For the north! Show them no mercy! Show them only the mercy of death. I will not rob will show up in time to. Aha! There goes the general. general lies dead. We ah, have killed him this time rather hell. than captured him. That should make their uh, guys run. I think. Any luck. The enemy are back. The enemy are bringing in reinforcements. Leave no survivors. Oh, I turned Irish there. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy! Just cut them down like sausages. Kill them all! Lord have mercy. We have lost half our men. Okay, here we are at the point where the front game froze last time. Our men are winning the battle. There is no if room for cowardice. Like we, we must charge and enemy. charge now. Come on, 
charge. It's time for plan B. Pull the fuck back now. <laughs> the Arons have outsmarted me and gone around the uh, castle. They've gone through the other gate, the one that I wasn't defending. So we get back, we join with Rob. Join up with Rob. Rob's host over here. Yeah, we pushed through, but I did not account for the giant army of douchebags over there. Actually, that gate belongs to me now, I think. So they can't get through it. very much in our favour. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Come on. See, they can't use the gate. <laughs> Idiots. They have officially trapped themselves, unless I go over here and actually use the gate. I'm hoping the Rob won't storm the sea gates or anything stupid like that. So let's just group my cavalry together for a second. We don't want to go inside until Rob's army's here. I mean, he's here, but uh, we don't want to go inside just yet. Not quite sure where Rob's going. I think he's attacking these guys around here. Which is what we will charge at for a second. Whoa, 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 Where the fuck are you going? What? Okay. The enemy's on the outside of the gates, dipshit. The battle is very much in our favor. I'm not really sure where Rob's army is going. Fast. Victory will be ours. Okay, maybe if I storm the gates and take it, they'll follow me.
God save us. The enemy have the walls. Look to our defense or all is lost. I don't reckon. Good tidings. No! The enemy general lies dead. Then we just lost reckon. We set the cart to hell. Ah, no, we killed their general. Thank God. I thought we just locked uh, Snark Man for a second. It looked kind of like we did for a second there, but thank God. Okay, are they going to come into the citadel or are they just going to sit on their asses not really doing anything? Uh, this is just going to turn out to be a epic fail moment, isn't it? <laughs> Battle. Turn them off. Like this, we will smash the enemy. Lads, the fear factor only actually works if you all charge at the same time. And not just sit back like cowards. Come on, seriously? Can I, like, I don't know, just get a fucking ladder or something? <laughs> Send you over here to the battle is grab very the much battle ladder. Favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Let's pull Rick on back before he gets himself killed. He's good, but I don't think he can even last that fucking long. Let's get my AI through the fucking gates because they are so fucking stupid sometimes. And, uh, yeah, well, if you want a demonstration of how fucking dumb the AI are, all you have to do is look at what's going on right now. <laughs> get another demonstration. Get through the pile of your fucking friendly units and hurry the hell up. So, the plan is here, that's... Get them on the ladders, I suppose. Put the ladders on the walls, and then hope that the AI is smart enough to attack over the ladders. At least I'm hoping that's what's going to happen, because otherwise we're fucked. <laughs> otherwise, I cannot get the AI to do shit. You know, unless the Arons are stupid enough to attack me. I'm not going to trust the AI. I think they're going through the thing, but... I think they might just be attacking. <laughs> so we'll get the ladders to the walls anyway. It might make them go in. Are now in place. Walls are no match for the valor and force of our arms. Yeah, they are. Sweet. Not very fast, though. They're just kind of seeping through. But Rob's are going in, so I'll send Rickon in.
kind of have a really bad feeling that the Rob's army is just gonna gonna sit outside the gate, not really fucking doing anything. <laughs> They do appear to be doing something. It's not fucking much. So I'll just use Rick in the run down as many of them as I can. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. See, I'm almost like 60% sure I could just make them all rout and then win. Only just with Rickon. The enemy force remains. If he dies, then uh all my plans are screwed. So, you are running over here, you claim, but you're not. Okay, some of the Rob's Our army are, are inside the, the castle, if but the rest of them like this, aren't. We will <laughs> smash the enemy! Okay, we'll pull Rob uh, Rickon back a bit. Okay, we could have like won this by now if Rob would actually, you know, use his giant army that's parked outside the gates. This is why you lost like the war, Rob. Seriously, man. Just what the hell? <laughs> have a huge army, but you just want to let your little brother deal with it. Because you're being a bitch. <laughs> I could use my army, but no. <laughs> I'm just going to leave it outside the gates, and uh, yeah, you do that. My guys are like 20 times better than this, but uh, <laughs> Rob is still sitting outside the arc fucking gates. Not actually outside the gates, inside the fucking gates. We control the gates, we have control of it, and we just don't control the gatehouse. Which you won't let me do. <laughs> Life away, and perhaps our chances of victory with it. Okay, this could end really fucking badly if Rob doesn't do anything. Because if Rob just sits outside and does absolutely nothing. The battle is the Arons are eventually going to kill my guys that I have left. Victory will be ours. <sighs> and if I lose my army, then I don't think Rob's just obviously going to be stuck outside, and because I have infinite timing on, <laughs> we're just going to be kind of fucked. Could have easily won this by now, like five minutes, ten minutes ago even, if Rob's AI army actually did anything. Okay, so we've got 29 guys in that. Our know, men like are winning the battle. If we continue like this, 30, we will smash the 34 enemy. or something, men. I don't know. Barely any fucking men is what I'm trying to say. There are some of the Stark AI and Rob's army inside the gates, but the rest of them just fucking sit in there doing nothing. So 
the stuck these guys on defense, and I hope that they'll be good enough to. I know they are. They are moving. Now that Reckon is probably dead, this was, this was Robert's plan all along. He's turned to the dark side. He's let his brother die, or he's captured. I'm not entirely sure. And uh, now he's moving in. Watch the fighting until Rob's army gets in. This was Rob's devious plan all along. Turns out, Rob's not an honourable person, he's incredibly evil. Fuck it, we'll let my brother die while he does all the work. And when he's dead, or captured, I'm not probably sure, I'm hoping that he's just captured. If he's dead, that'll kind of suck. There's probably people sitting there going, oh, where, where? Of course he's dead, well, you heard him say dead, but you don't understand what I'm recording. I can't actually hear what's going on. I can barely hear it, because I don't want it, the voices and shit coming through my speakers on my TV to actually, you know, come through the mic, because then you'll get echoing sounds and shit whenever someone dies and all that kind of stuff, so we don't want that happening. So I can barely hear what's going on. Rob's army has arrived. And Goldtown is ours in 40 seconds. 30 seconds. So, never mind, appeal. it's ours now. This is a clear victory that goes to only okay. Um, it's, it's probably more likely that Rickon's dead. It's just been being hopeful that he may have been captured. I'm not entirely sure. It's never happened that I've noticed. <laughs> I've but I've seen of I've probably like never seen my uh Yeah Glory to the King for Scotland I've never seen any of my friendly generals returned or like captured or anything like that. Ooh, the Lord of High Garden is dead. Yep, the Gold Town has plague. Yeah, he died. My king. I'm honored, my lord. By your will, sire, talk is cheap. For the honor of Scotland, we march to battle. There is precisely zero fucking. Uh, Rob has two sites of famous battles all in the same year. Which is quite an accomplishment. Unfortunately, Rick and Stark is dead. Now we have, like, zero fucking. Zero, uh. Public order is the one I was looking for there. So it's probably going to be lost in the next turn. Taking the rebels, and then we'll just take it back from the rebels and uh, assimilate them all. <laughs> Even with Rob's army. He'll only put a little dent on his uh, public order thing, but... An honor, my lord. For the honor of Scotland. We march to battle. <laughs> Royce is the uh, Lord of the Eerie now. Whatever, goodbye. 
A proud victory for Scotland's finest. Someone took Bainfort. Ah, uh, not Bainfort. Uh, Redfort. I have no idea who did that. Or actually, no. It's probably just because I killed all their generals. Okay, if I send a bunch more guys over to Goldtown. I sire. I lord. I don't want to send Rob because I don't want to risk him dying of plague. <laughs> My king. I. I sire. I lord. I. I lord. I. Leaving the army. There you go. Now it shouldn't rebel against my authority. Onward. Okay. After that, we just need to take Red Fort. What the hell was left of it? Uh, Salt Pans has no longer got rebellion. Ah! What the hell's with the lag, man? My king. Aye. Let's go over there. Forward. I don't know why the hell my, game, no my computer is doing today. this today, but there you go. Now, there's one thing that I've really been interested in doing, Where's which is killing point? Bolton when I find a rebel force of some description that I can use. They're usually up here somewhere. I don't know what the hell's with the lag. Sudden frame rate drop Bolton. out of nowhere. <laughs> we may camp here, lads. I need to find uh, like a rebel troop and I can just kill off Ramsey. But yeah, that's how Saren dealt with anyway, so there's no need. No more problems from them, at the very least. We just need to retrain our men, take the Red Fort, or whatever the hell it's called. I think it's called Red Fort, relatively sure it is. Uh oh. The rebels are attacking me. They are dead. I'm just taking antlers. For Scotland! I mean, yes, well I done, lads! We've won! That way I won't have any trouble, problems. Do I want to marry Sansa to a fray? Fuck no. <laughs> Long story short there, fuck no. Yep, if Rob had moved faster, I wouldn't have to risk bloody uh, Rickon's life and now he's dead. Aye. Move out. My king. Aye. Mark. Aye, lord. My king. Aye, Lord. My king. Aye. Aye, Lord. Onward. Aye. Move out. Here we go, King's Landing. I'll give Oathkeeper to Rob when he comes down here to deal with the rest of Stannis' men. Aye, sire. Aye, sire. And we'll send Aye, this army here Onward. back over to Castle Rock to be trained. That army will stay in King's Landing at all times. That'll be the new... Uh, it won't be the new capital, I don't think. But it will be like the princes, if you know what I mean. If you know how, uh, I don't know. You know how uh, the Baratheons thing worked when Robert took King's Landing? He gave Renly, Storm's End, and Stannis got Dragonstone. So once everything's done and all peace and we are kings, uh, King of Westeros, because that's what we're going for. Fuck to stay in King of the North. We will control Aye, all of Westeros and everyone will bow, believe us. Uh, I'll give... The heir and the prince of Winter, uh, the prince of the prince of the North, or whatever the hell we'll call him, because uh, they don't get the prince of Winterfell trait, I don't think. But still, uh, the prince will get King's Landing, and the king will rule from Winterfell. That's the plan, anyway. Aye. He's got gold to worry about at the moment. I want to find somewhere that we can kill Ramsay. Moving out. Have a claymore <laughs> for you here, Jimmy. We shall slaughter oh, Ramsay. This is great. We can kill Ramsay and then call it a day. Kill them all. <laughs> Be prepared for spam. You'll see in a minute what I mean. For anyone that ever wants to kill off a general that you don't like, here's how you do it. What's it, loads? Our foes appear to be gaining the upper hand in this battle. Promise me, Ned. Promise me you won't reveal that that John is a fray. Dun dun dun. <laughs> Just kill me now. Just fucking kill me now. If, if Rob turns out to be a fray, that's just the kind of thing George would think. Hmm. They want John to be a Targaryen. We'll do the complete opposite of what they want. Anyway, I won't be. You won't hear me talk for a while because I'll be doing this. 
Die, Ramsey, you are a fucking bastard. We hate you all. Die faster, you prick. Or a military genius can bring us victory from this mess. Die, Ramsey, you stuck up fucking virgin. Virgin? Virgin? I was gonna say virgin, but then I was like, wait, no, wait, no, no, no. He's just crazy. God damn it, he's supposed to die faster. There he goes. Woohoo, he's dead. Suck on that. Ramsey, you stuck up fucking prick. Well, that's my day done. That's my that's a, today's uh, job done, right there. Goodbye, Ramsey. I'd say you'd be missed, but I'd be lying for my ass. So there you go. <laughs> Fucking Boltons. And if you don't know why I just did that, you haven't read the books yet. <laughs> okay, guys. It's been half an hour, so that's all for now. Uh, when we come back, it's... I don't know. Should we... I'm just debating whether or not we should be like 10 turns ahead when everything's retrained and then move on Stannis. Because, I don't know, the, the next couple of turns is just going to be me retraining Rob's army and moving it on the... What are you doing? Okay guys, we'll end it here. I think my dog's about to be sick. So guys, annotation, top right hand side. That's all for now. Soul out.